take a look at how the lessons for computer science fundamentals are structured. Each lesson begins with an overview that includes a small table giving you an idea of what the lesson will cover. There's a getting started section where you and your students will access your prior knowledge and build excitement for the learning activity to come. Once you're geared up, you can dive into the activity section of the lesson, where you will be helping your students work through either a tutorial on Code Studio or an unplugged activity that you run in your classroom. The lesson will finish with a wrap-up section, where you'll debrief and highlight important CS concepts that were illustrated during the activity. Of course, you'll probably want to create your own lesson plans and curriculum for your computer science classroom. If you do, here are some tips that you might want to keep in mind. Tip 1. Try using a spiraling curriculum design. Introduce concepts once and then revisit them throughout your lesson plans and throughout the year to help reinforce the concepts. Tip 2. Create a blended learning experience. Students shouldn't be on the computer 100% of the time when they're learning computer science. Building unplugged activities into your curriculum helps students apply their computer science learning to the real world. Tip 3. Break your curriculum down into bite-sized chunks. At Code.org, we use stages and levels, but whatever you want to call them in your classroom, make sure students understand that learning computer science is a journey with many steps. Tip 4. The last tip. Make sure that whatever curriculum you're developing is aligned to your local standards and college and career readiness skills. At the end of each of our lessons, you'll find links to Common Core State standards and other technology standards that will help you tailor your lessons so that your students learn the things they need in order to be successful.